This video will show how personnel who need to move between a launch boat and a larger vessel can do so safely. At the pier, ensure that you are physically fit and well and are able to climb a pilot ladder. Do not board the vessel during bad weather conditions. Before boarding the launch, check that you have put on your life jacket properly. Keep the life jacket on till you have arrived at the ship deck safely. Make sure you have the following appropriate personal protective equipment for boarding and getting off the vessel. If you are carrying any loose items, pack them into a bag. The bag will be lifted onto the vessel separately. Always keep your hands on the handrail when using the stairway to get to the launch boat. Hand over any bags or personal belongings to the launch assistant. Mind the gap between the launch and the pier when boarding. Remain seated throughout the entire launch ride to the ship. A ship crew should be present to receive you as the launch approaches the vessel. The crew should also hoist any belongings onto the vessel if needed. Once the launch has arrived and is lined up alongside the vessel, you may board the vessel. However, you have the right not to board the vessel if you feel unsafe. The launch will sway with the currents, so you should hold on to the handrail at all times. Ensure that you have a good sense of balance before stepping onto the pilot ladder. Do not hold onto any bags or objects. Always ensure that there are three points of contact with the ladder. Follow the launch master or assistant's instructions carefully. When you receive the command, and when the launch is about the same level as the ladder, you should step onto the ladder. Grab the ladder at face level, then step off the launch and onto a higher rung. Climb at least five steps to get yourself away from the launch. It is important to always maintain three-point contact. Keep your eyes on the ladder and tuck your body close to the ladder. Only one person is allowed on the pilot ladder at a time. To cross from the pilot ladder onto the gangway, continue to climb until your feet are at the same level or slightly higher than the gangway. Step one foot onto the gangway and cross over only when on firm footing. Maintain three-point contact at all times. Once on the gangway, hold onto the handrail with both hands, maintain three-point contact, and proceed slowly up to the deck. Take a short rest if you feel tired. You should not wait for the person behind you. You will only be allowed to go to the launch if the sea conditions are safe. You may decline if you feel that it is unsafe or if you are feeling unwell. Make sure that you have put on the proper personal protective equipment, especially your life jacket. Keep both hands on the handrail as you walk down the gangway. Upon reaching the pilot ladder, grab onto it with one hand and begin climbing down while maintaining three-point contact at all times. Stay alert to your surroundings while climbing down the ladder. As you get nearer to the bottom, listen closely to the instructions from the launch master or the assistant. They will instruct you when it is safe to transfer. When you receive the command, get onto the launch only when it is about the same level as the ladder. Proceed to let go of the ladder and place one foot onto the deck of the launch. At the same time, reach for the handrail. Transfers between vessels can be safe if you take the necessary precautions. Always stay alert and be aware of your surroundings. Look out for hazards such as unsafe sea conditions, slipping off the pilot ladder rung, falling off the pilot ladder during transfer, tripping hazards on launch and vessel. Falling into the water can be avoided. However, if it happens, remember to stay calm, keep your head above water, wave for help, and hold on to a life buoy thrown by the launch. Do your part and stay safe at all times.